Ah, hey everybody, Dave here. Day tw uh, episode twenty-one, day ninety-eight. It is uh, November tenth. No, excuse me, December tenth. It is um, what is it? It's about seven o'clock in the morning. It's about thirty degrees here. I am in Manhattan Beach, um, Brooklyn, also known as New York City. I give you a little sunrise there as the camera is pointed towards the east. As the sun rises in the east. Uh, it always looks worse here in my camera, but I think it always looks better in your camera. I think you got a little yellow there, a little orange, a little white, a little glare. There's the ocean, a little bit of a pier that used to exist. You can see some rocks over there, and you can see the foundation wall, the path. It's about two-tenths of a mile from one side to the other. And, um, you know, of course, there's um, Queens over there directly across the bay. And then as I turn around, there's more of New Jersey, which really doesn't matter us. Uh, I just figured I'd give you a little perspective as, of where I'm at, where I'm standing. Um, and somewhere out there is a ship, and uh, you know, I'm very obsessed with the ships. And uh, way beyond me is the Verrazano Bridge, which you cannot see. All right. So anyway, wow, the lighting is really good today, although I look like hell. Uh, anyway, it's uh, 7 o'clock in the morning. So I woke up at about 3.15 this morning, and I headed down here. I stopped in Manhattan to take a look at something on West 59th Street. Um, and I missed an exit, but it's no big deal. I, you know, I lost a little time. Uh, I didn't hit any traffic. Um, but I'm doing a public access show or something like that, some sort of show. Um, this Friday, I'll be recording it, and uh, somebody you know, has a show, I'll be a guest, and then they'll be airing it sometime in January or something like that. So I'll keep you posted. Um, but I, I went to go uh, scout the uh, area for parking which, you know, in Manhattan is really a foolish thing to do because there's never any parking. I don't know how any of those cars are parked in Manhattan. I think they're like, um, they're like decoys. You know, they're not real cars, they're not real spots. They're just uh, cars that look like cars, you know, things that look like cars and those are spots that look like spots. Just to give you the impression that you, you might have some accessibility to Manhattan, but there really is no accessibility. You have to take a train, you have to walk. Anyway, so I'm going to reserve a spot in a garage probably. I won't have to deal with any hassle looking for a spot. All right, so we're three minutes in and I've said nothing. All right, so once again, December 10th at 7 o'clock in the morning. It's about 30 degrees outside. It's kind of cold. Um, Dave's Fit Life. What am I going to do this week? I think this is going to be the last week for me here, um, the last full week for me here. I want to save some of my leave time for when my mom uh, goes back to uh, her house, which is the goal, uh, you know, which is about 10 miles, 10 minutes away from here. So uh, I'm getting a lot more comfortable. I'm definitely way better this Monday than I was last Tuesday. Uh, I'm definitely more comfortable with the situation and uh, more happy with the progress. Sorry about the microphone situation here. But uh, anyway, um, yeah, that microphone is right here. And I know I'm ruffling it. It sounds horrible. But I'm, I apologize. Um, so, um, yeah, that's what I want to do. I want to get my mom 100%. Uh, I, I, by the way, I bought her like a, a coloring book and some other stuff. Things that she could do to occupy her time when she's doing nothing. And that's really a thing that I can't have her doing, which is a lot of nothing. I have to have her doing something. Not all the time, but enough of the time where she's using her fingers and she's using her brain and her vision and she's finding a way to uh, having control over something. Because right now, the biggest thing that she's holding on to is that uh, uh, remote, which uh, uh, calls the nurses. She's really attached to that thing where she can hit the button and get a nurse in there. She's not relaxed at all. Uh, not in my eyes, she's not. Uh, she's relaxed to a lot of people. But to me, when you're holding on to that button, that's your. That's like her, you know, it's just... Um, it's an emergency button. It's a panic button. And she's holding on to it all the time. So I want to get her to relax and start holding on to crayons and, and other things and turning pages and magazines and coloring books and things like that. Um, so what else is there? Uh, so Dave's Fit Life. What am I going to fit in this week? I like to walk every day. I'm going to be here for four or five days. I like to walk every day. Um, and I think what I'm going to do is start walking a lot early in the day because it's really cold. So instead of waiting till 8 o'clock and uh, sneaking in a shower here, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to walk really early in the afternoon. Like when my mother's done with physical therapy, I walk about 1, 1 30, 2 o'clock, maybe 2.30. I'm going to go for a two-hour walk in the afternoon, you know, late afternoon, early evening, uh, before the sun sets. How about that? That's my goal. Get a, you know, about six miles in. We'll see how the feet and the legs work this week. They were working pretty good last week. So, um, you know, I'm not going to give you, a, let me say 20 miles. Maybe I'll do 20 miles this week. I'll walk four or five days this week. Uh, and I'll shower at my father's house instead of sneaking in a shower here. Because I've done that here. I, there's a room I can sneak in a shower. But it really feels very weird <laughs> um, doing that. You know, like the door is locked. But I still feel like, hey, you're not supposed to be showering here. 
this is not really where I live. <laughs> and, you know, there's no problem with showering at my father's house. It's just, it's a lot more Harold time. And I'm not really sure I'm really interested in that. It's, it's too much time, I think, really, at this point. Anyway, Dave's Fit Life. I'm not going to be sleeping in the fit. I drove down here with the fit. I'm going to drive back with the fit. I'm going to fit walking into my life and try to get some more fitness. That's really it. And uh, really try to watch what I eat and definitely work on the sleep. Last week, I, I don't remember. I should, I should know that. Uh, if I slept four hours a day, five hours, six hours a day. I'm not really feeling sleep deprived right now. But um, I could do better. I could always do better. Seven hours is the goal. I would love to be able to say to you, no doubt about it. I've been sleeping every day, six to seven hours. But that's not really the case. Um, what else is there? That's it. That's uh, Dave's Fit Life right now this week. Uh, as uh, I'm going to go into that building there and help my mom with rehab. Sonia, by the way, for some of you who said, hey, how come you don't mention her name? And um, my buddy Alex Exum uh, from the Exum Experience and also from Live Talk has said to me, you need to show those pictures a little bit better. So, you know, I'll, do, I'll take a picture of the pictures and uh, I'll post them in the Facebook group. How about that? So go to Dave's Fit Life, my Facebook group, and, you know, whatever it is, HTTP, blah, 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 Dave's Fit Life on Facebook. Go there. Um, well, oh, by the way, there's a balloon here in the pad. Look at this balloon. It's just hanging out with me. Oh, where's it going? Oh, no, it's going to go into the water. Where did that thing come from? Wow. Right, I hope some seagull doesn't choke on that balloon. Oh, now that it's wet, it'll never fly again. Sad Wilson. Anyway, <laughs> a little visual trick there. All right. Wow, that's a much better view, right? The sun is really doing good over there. Should have done this from the beginning. Um, beautiful sky. Some of you really enjoy this. This really beautiful sunrise. You know, there's airplanes in the air. There's birds in the air. I love it here. I really wish, <laughs> once again, I really wish my mother had stroked out, like, in a really much nicer time of the year. So do the, do yourself a favor. When you go talk to your parents today, say, listen, don't stroke out today and try to wait to like the last day of winter so I can enjoy the spring and the summer while I'm taking care of you. It's only fair. You know, try to time it. Take your vitamins and take your medicine. But if you're going to stop, stop when it gets warmer. Anyway, it's really beautiful here. I hope some of you aren't offended by that. It's just kidding. You should never really time your stroke. You should just stroke out whenever you want. Feel, feel free to stroke out. That, you know, you know, whether it's going to be a blood clot or, you know, stroke or, you know, a heart attack or diabetes. You feel free to have those ailments whenever you want. You know, this is America. You can, there's no rules or regulations about that. All right, eight minutes. See, now I know I'm getting to a territory. It's like, hey, you're, you're treading on dangerous, dangerous water here, Dave. Just do the show. Say goodbye. Thank everybody. Oh, I got four new subscribers since the other day. So I don't know who they are. By the way, YouTube, I can't find out who you are. If your YouTube channel is private, it won't tell me that you're a new subscriber. So for those of you who have private YouTube accounts, um, I can't thank you when I look up the list of people who have subscribed. Uh, but for those of you who have opened public uh, YouTube accounts, it tells me your name. So thank you, everybody, who has subscribed. I have 70 subscribers, which is you know, pretty good. It's you know, 28 less than I want right now. So please keep on reposting this, you know, uh, sharing this on Facebook, uh, Instagram. i got to do some more Instagram work this week, some Twitter work. And um, that's going to be another thing I'm going to fit in. Some more Twitter, some more Instagram, and uh, you know, whatever other dopey social uh, network it is. But really, the social network, the social media I need to do is right here. I'm talking to you. Please do me a favor. Tell your friends, hey, I got this buddy. You, know, you don't even have to watch it. Just subscribe to it. I know that sounds stupid, right? Just hit, click the subscribe button. Nobody, nobody's getting emails, right? Nobody's getting any spam. Nobody's being, uh, you know, offered, uh, you know, I'm not soliciting anything. I'm not selling anything. Just subscribe. Just help me build up a subscriber account. You click subscribe and you walk away and nothing ever happens. It's really dopey, but that's, I guess, how YouTube works. Thank you, everybody. Dave's Fit Life, December 10th. 7 o'clock in the morning, 30 degrees. I'm going to hang this up. I'm going to shut off the button. 10-minute uh, thing. That should have been a 5-minute thing. And uh, go upstairs and start moving back in. One more week, hopefully. This will be the last week. Hopefully, I'll have good news at the end of the week. The mom's doing great. She's coloring in the coloring book. She's walking. She's talking. She's doing things. And, um, and I'm going to go back to work eventually. Maybe next week. Maybe one more week. Oh, I could use a break. You know what I'm talking about? All right. See you later. Thanks, guys. Bye. Don't forget. Subscribe. Bye.